Well, guys, time is short. Uh, basically, I'm going to cut to the chase right now. Uh, it's looking like anybody that has ever supported Trump or is a patriot and believes in freedom, uh, their time is very, very short for being on the Internet. Uh, it's, it's definitely looking like, you know, I don't have a timeline. I don't know when it's going to happen, but it seems like the next attack that's going to come on, on conservative people that have ever been conservative is going to be deplatforming. They're going to take the videos off, obviously, YouTube first. They're going to take off the social media. They're going to take off the, uh, then they're going to go for the ISPs, you won't have internet. And I'm a fighter. I, I find a way no matter what. Uh, they can't, they can't keep you down permanently. Plus, uh, you know, I, I, I always figure out a way, you know what I'm saying? So the first thing is, is if you ever liked my work, consider supporting and I try to make it as easy as possible. I offer some great services, an accountability program. Right now, obviously, I can't do a boot camp with you, but I can teach you some stuff about business, being resilient, entrepreneurship, and then obviously game uh, for an affordable price, uh, plus the accountability program. And also I have a traction accelerator. So if you've ever uh, thought about supporting me and checking out my product, it's fucking awesome. I put a, low, a ton of time into it. Uh, the problem is, is that the days are probably limited. You know, they're, they're probably going to come after anyone that doesn't, you know, that has ever fucking supported Trump. And because I did, I committed the crime of that. They're probably going to come after my shit. So I'm just letting you know, if you ever wanted to support me, you know, now would really be the time and I'd really appreciate it. And you get a great product in return. Now, the next thing I want to say is this too, is that they're coming for you too. Uh, so the thing to do right now would be to prepare. So you're going to want to... Um, do a bunch of stuff. I mean, the first thing would be, I mean, there's a bunch of stuff. You want to secure your food and your water. You want to secure your self-defense. You want to get cash out of the bank because again, they, you know, clearly th this is a merging, this is 1984 shit. They are merging um, corporations and government and they're punishing political dissidents, just like in China. So if, if you don't meet the social credit score, you're going to be shut down. And there's no promise that you will not be shut down. If you've watched a Trump rally, they, they can just change it whenever they want. That's what they do. So you're going to want to get all those things in order. Uh, for more info on that, watch my other videos. My, that's the most important thing. It's just be prepped yourself. I'm not trying to scare you, but again, I've been saying this again and again and again for a long time because... It, uh, it is accelerating now, and now is the time where, you know, they're going to hit the internet kill switch. Either Trump's going to step up and stop this, or patriots are going to have to step up and, and try to stop this. And uh, it's, just, it's just absolutely coming to a head right now. <laughs> you know, good versus evil, absolutely coming to a head. Uh, now, in that, uh, that's going to mean for me and any other people that have spoken out uh, against communism and these fags that are these faggots, there's no doubt about it. They're absolute faggots. They're weak, strung out losers and women that literally are trying to authoritarian, like, like just clamp down on anything that they don't agree with. They would never, ever, ever be able to do a one-on-one -on -one fight. Never. They never have and they never will because they're cowards and they're fucking pathetic. So they're going to use big tech. They're going to use the financial systems. They're going to use every... I, I know exactly what these people are like. I've known them very, very well for a long time. And they, 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 can't, they can't physically fight you. They can't debate you based on ideas because they don't stand on any. So they use their power to crush you. That's what they do. That's what they do. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. And they, they won't feel bad about it at all. They'll go on a vacation right afterwards. They'll... they'll <laughs> I'm telling you, I know from personal experience how ruthless these people are and how little they care about you. They'll, they'll fucking, you'll be dying and they'll go on a vacation. I've seen it. I've seen it. And, and, and there's no, nobody is exempt in their lives from it either. So I'm just telling you, if you think that you're going to buy time or appease a leftist, you're not. These are ideological pieces of shit. So they're, they, they have no, they're anti-humanists, they don't love their family, they don't love their friends, they don't love themselves. They don't give a shit. 
So please stop with the with the oh Brad, you know, oh it's all over. We're gonna give up. I'm not giving up. I'm just being real with you that this is coming down the pike, and I been planning for it for a long time and I've taken out a lot of action on it actually so I'm I'm pretty I'm okay I'm gonna survive like and I'm a fighter so I'm not giving up but what I'm saying is is this is that when you're in it it's gonna it gives you a sense of anxiety that's why I'm a little anxious right now to be honest but with that said um, that's why I'm coming to you again just plugging my products I make it super easy to uh, to support because reality is, is that they're probably going to shut down my business. I mean, they've kicked my business so many times. They've ruined it so many times with censorship and the COVID thing. They've ruined it. I mean, it's, it's been so many times of this that, um, you know, I, I, I'm not worried about it. Again, there's always a way <laughs> until they kill me or until I die of natural causes, I'll still be fighting. So I don't need YouTube, I don't need my blog even, I don't need any of that to make sales and figure it out. It's just going to take a while and it's going to suck shit. So <laughs> I'm just saying, man, like I've been through it a few times and, and, and this time it's just like yet another kick while you're down, you know. Business was starting to pick up and do well again and then then this is this is happening. It's, it's going to happen. I don't know when it's going to happen. I hope I'm wrong. I don't think so, though, to be honest with you. I, I, if you've committed the crime of supporting Donald Trump and not going along with this fucking bullshit narrative, you're going to get banned. Now, keep in mind, this is all they have. The left, in real life, are, like I said, they are pathetic losers. They're nobodies. They've never created anything. You know, you're talking about people that are either, you know, corporate you know, they were just cogs in a machine of a business they didn't build, they, or, or they're women that, you know, just divorced their husband or something, or they're getting money from their husband, or they're rich kids, or they're getting money from George Soros, it's whatever the fuck it is. They, they've never really created anything good. You know what I'm saying? So they're weak and pathetic, and, and they have this arrogance and hubris. It's 1984 shit all over again. So when you meet face to face with them, don't ever be scared. All they have is this psyop shit. All they have is they leverage power, whether it be money or the internet or censorship, to try to to try to make you be afraid. But realize there are so many more patriots worldwide than there are these fucking people. There are so many more fucking patriots. And what they want is for you to be demoralized. Do not be demoralized. Realize you will win in the end. God wins in the end. They're not going to fucking win. They're going to pay for what they did. That's what's going to be, whether it means the destruction of, of me and other people too, to, 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 to just end this, this evil shit, this evil shit of trying to control what other people can and can't say, what they can and can't do in business because you don't like it, you want control. Meanwhile, you are the most evil, loserous fucking faggot I've ever seen in my life. Literally, you, you have to dress in black. You have to bitch and complain. You're for abortion. You love abortion. You love Bernie Sanders, who's a turncoat. Like, go fuck yourself. Go fuck yourself. You mock white people. Most racist people I've ever met in my life are, are leftists. And, 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 and these turncoats in, in government, I mean, it's just all of them. Just, it's got to stop. It can't continue. So the point is, is that they're probably going to completely deplatform me. You know, they're, they're going to deplatform everyone. You know what I'm saying? They're going to threaten you with, with finances, with, with the police, you know, the, the, the deep state police and all this. And whether Trump wins or loses, if Trump wins, this shit's going to go away immediately. <laughs> Man, that would be a great day. Uh, and I have some good news for you at the end. If he loses, we're in for a literal war. Uh, there's no way around it. It, it is going to be an absolute war on everything that is good in this world globally like it's it's not just me here it's everyone on the in, in the world you know if america falls guys the world is gonna follow i'm telling you that that's my prediction i'm not wishing it on you but dude it's looking like it's gonna be that way so here's some good news though so out of this the cool thing is that there's um there's gonna be other isps that start up that are based that are that are not promoting they're not going to bend the knee to this fucking gay mob um there's going to be other uh 
just businesses that are just not putting up with this. They're not going to bend the knee to this shit. There's going to be like parallel economies. There's a great, uh, there's a great new social media network called Gab, which uh, they're promoting encrypted chats. They, uh, it's all about free speech and Christianity. And dude, go to Gab. There, there have been so many new people that joined up on Gab that like, if you can get an internet connection, you can restart your business there. So you can, you know, download your videos and re-upload them there. Or as soon as we create some new thing that's not gay and, and super like restrictive about what you can and can't say about the truth, then that's where we're going to wind up. And that's going to be the source of the new economy, you know, but, but we're going to have a fucking war on our hands, guys. If Trump loses, if he really doesn't have a plan. If QAnon is totally a LARP and Trump is totally just a LARP and it's just fucking bullshit and, and, and we're fucked, then we're fucked. We're all fucked. You realize that, right? Like, not just conservatives. Liberals are fucked. They're going to crash the dollar. You're going to you have a globalist. And, <laughs> they're planning the Great Reset right after Biden gets installed. It's going to be a shit show <laughs> unlike anything you've, <laughs> you could possibly imagine. Um... And you're a fucking moron if you're supporting this. So that's it, man. Uh, please consider supporting me uh, and the business. If you've enjoyed my content over the years, I hate asking this, but honestly, dude, it's just like it's kind of the end of the fucking road here. You know, I don't think I don't think they're gonna let me uh, even have a website or a YouTube or anything. You know, Th these leftists are sadistic losers, and. Um, they just love doxing. It's pretty ironic because then when you... What I encourage you to do, by the way, is when someone threatens to dox you, get their information. Use their tactic, tactics back on them. They threaten to dox you, look at their shit, and be like, oh, cool, I'm going to call your boss right now. Call them, and then, you know, make up something about them. And uh, maybe they get fired too. You know, maybe it's... Because, it, again, like, don't just let them do this to you. Stop playing by the rules. It's It's not fair. It's not fair. If the rules are rigged against you, break the fucking rules. You know, when I said that to this guy that was like, oh, I'm tell I'm going to call the FBI because he went to the, the rally in D.C. He literally tagged the FBI in one of my posts, which had nothing to do with anything. It was like a literal fucking political post. He's just a fucking faggy leftist, whatever. He tagged it and he's an idiot. So I, I saw his shit. I'm like, oh, cool. And, I, and he'd been talking shit before on another platform, looked him up, and I'm like, oh, cool. I see you work there. Well, maybe your employer is going to get a nice call. You know what he said? He was like, oh, we don't need to do that. Like, you know, let's just break off communication. So I was like, huh, funny. Funny how you were so ballsy before I knew where you worked. You know, funny how you were saying uh, I deserve to go to jail for 20 years for going to a fucking rally. That's, that's, I'm just saying, that's what I'm dealing with. You know, people tell me, oh, you got to go to jail for 10 years, 20 years for supporting Trump. You're an enabler of Trump. Hmm pretty interesting how that works so that's my two cents um and get your preps in order consider supporting stack your own money get cash and get water get food be ready man because it's accelerating again it may it may it may not be tonight may not be tomorrow may not be three months but they're definitely trying this shit for sure they say what they're gonna do so god help us man peace